It's the middle of the week and we're heading out to the new zoo. Neil Anderson joins us from Swamico. Hi, Neil. Well, good morning, guys. Uh, we're inside our new education building. And, you know, one thing that's fantastic this year is you can take a look at our education classroom, uh, which is fantastic. It's probably about, I would say, 10 times the size of our old classroom. So we're able to do a lot of different things now. You're going to see a lot of programs coming up. Uh, so uh, either check our website, uh, we'll be getting announcements out. But one of the things that we have going on over the next two weeks here are zoo camps. And you can see everything is all set up inside here uh, for the little kids to come in. And uh, they'll spend a, a week out here at the zoo, which is this week and next week, doing all different activities and getting connected with a lot of the animals. Now, the, the one thing that's really really nice with this particular exhibit. It was designed so we can also bring animals out as well. So if we look in this back area, when you have education program animals, one of the things that you want to be able to do is you want to be able to house them close to your education classroom. In the past, a lot of our education program animals, like for instance over here, the armadillo, we'd have to go uh, in the zoo and uh, pick up uh, the animal, bring it back, and of course, especially you know when you're looking at weather, whether it's rainy today or it's in the winter or whatever, uh, that becomes uh, you know a real difficult task trying to get everybody ready to go for programming. This particular room that we are in is our education program animals. Now, when they go out uh, onto whether it's out in the zoo or out in the community with our zoo mobile. Uh, they return here and it serves kind of like a quarantine so that they do not go back in with the rest of the population. So you can see we got the armadillo in here. This particular room too is, has its own climate control system. The walls can be scrubbed down. Um, it, uh, it has its own air uh, handling system as well. So we're not mixing the animal air with the people air out there. But I want to check you, you guys can check this out too. We just started moving all our animals in here but take a look at the size of that bullfrog. <laughs> That's an African bullfrog and I'll tell you what, when you take that little guy out there with the little kids, I mean their eyes are just about as big as this guy, uh, but they really love it. But yeah, we're getting everything set up in here, moving all our animals in from chinchillas, guinea pigs, and a number of other animals. So uh, we're excited to have a new education classroom like this and uh, we can't wait to deliver more education programs to you guys. With that, back to you guys.